All right, so Coach, how good does it feel to get that first series win under your belt here so early? <laughs> Feels great. I mean, um, no, what, what you want the kids to see, being the new guy, bringing the, a different, you know, program, bringing the different philosophy, bringing the different standard, you want them to, to reap some of the benefits of all the changes they're going through. So it's nice for them to, you know, see that part of it with how we do everything. And uh, so that just reiterates kind of what I'm preaching and what I'm teaching. So it's good for them to see a, a, a result out of that. And great pitching tonight, you know, uh, no earned runs, only two hits allowed through nine. How happy were you with the guys on the mound today? Oh, the guys on the mound are everything. And you know, the, the good thing for us and the scary thing for us is Mason Burns yesterday and Lane tonight, um, their better days are still ahead of them. Both of them will tell you that they didn't have their best days, you know, but they competed. And all I ever ask for every position player and every pitcher is you try to match up with the other guy across the field at that position and you try to be better than them. And the more we got around the field matching up with those guys and being better than them at defense, uh, at hitting, in this case with Lane now on the mound, you know, that's that's what you got to do. So he competed and did that. And then obviously Jones, he came in and just did spectacular for us. And Ty Bodice is just a, a great outing. You with 3-4 and that lone strikeout was still really great at bat. Yes. How, how happy were you with his performance today? I mean, that's what we expect from him. Unfortunately, you know, he, he, uh, he's got some experience, got a ton of ABs from last year, got, I think, like nearly 200 ABs from last year. So coming in as a sophomore, we don't really treat him as a sophomore. Uh, and there's expectations that come with it. So uh, that was nice to see, nice to have him do what he did. And uh, yesterday was the sixth, today was the seventh. How were you guys able to make adjustments so late in ball games to, you know, take over? <laughs> take over? I wish I knew because <laughs> I'd move it to like the second and third inning to start with. But uh, better late than never. Um, and again, with a lot of the things we're teaching, what we're looking for, how we're trying to make adjustments. Uh, maybe it's just taking them a little time that way, but there's constant communication in the dugout what we're looking for, what each hitter's seen, and I think they're doing a great job with that. So whether we end up scoring in the first or second or seventh or eighth, I mean, I'll, I'll take it the way it is. But uh, uh, I think, you know, overall, our better days are ahead of us still. Thank you so much, Coach.